NC10 netbook that I've got from a friend for free and um, since the battery that we have here that's the battery um, it has 100 mAh hours I'm sorry for the misspelling at this point and yeah uh, the battery is empty I don't got a charger yet and what I'm planning to do is to install micro XP on it which I have here on this USB stick um, but the problem is I yeah first need to get the hard drive out and throw it into my main PC and try to install it there or I try to install it on my laptop I hope you will like this building process so after we removed all the screws sitting here 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 over here 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 here's one two two here and here is the last one and this is unnecessary because it just the cover for the 1200 uh, megabytes of memory I believe and I have all these screws already gotten out and the next frame will be the open laptop um, a little note here it's kind of hard to open because this cover thing is a son of a bitch and um, yeah I will get a little rough with it um, but since I don't have a camera mount yet you guys won't see it so here you can see the open laptop with the hard drive bay here um, and this is the RAM here we have here we have the network card from Samsung and no I'm sorry this is the Bluetooth card I guess and this should be the network card if I'm wrong please correct me in the comments and yeah here we have the little fan that covers the CPU, the Intel Atom processor, by the way the specs from this machine are linked in the description down below. Here we have my boot menu, here is my USB stick with micro XP installed on it and here is the um, Hitachi solder HDD from the netbook and um, yeah let's just try to boot the sucker up yes windows xp setup please um auto detect would be the best i guess then install the first part press any key to continue Yeah, no, we don't need to install additional software and stuff here. Come on. A little update since it wouldn't work with micro XP. I try Tiny7 now. Um, since it works with the normal Windows 7, I will go with this option and I will see you guys hopefully in the Tiny7 installation screen. So for the um, yeah, installment on the USB stick, I use WinSetup from USB. Uh, I also will link this software down in the description below. I will tune in when we are hopefully on the install screen. So as we see here, finally Windows is installing on the HDD from the laptop, but the problem is since um, the XP setup wouldn't run on my main PC, I switched to my Dell laptop to install Windows 7 on the HDD from the netbook. And because I don't know if I mentioned it earlier, but I don't have the uh, power cable 
from the netbook so I can't test it and um, when I got the power cable I will make a first boot and a test video so here we can see that the installation was successful again it's on my the laptop and here we can see the windows um, yeah Windows 7 in the control panel menu and here you see the specs from my laptop and here you can see um, the memory it runs on 298 megabytes um, in a second video I will test all the stuff with the Samsung MC10 netbook I hope you enjoyed this video write a comment down below and tell me what I could make better um, and yeah cheers